So welcome to UMT Marine Research Station, Pulau Bidong. Let's explore together with us. Uh, so we've been diving for the past three days and uh, I've really enjoyed the dives, uh, learning different kinds of survey techniques under the guidance of the academics. The moment it has been great. We've been doing different uh, uh, snorkeling techniques and also different transects. So we've been recording all the species we've seen of corals and uh, I guess in the few days uh, we've got left here we'll be doing more transects and trying to discover all the amazing wildlife there is here in Bedong. We arrived in Kapas two days ago, and ever since it's been a roller coaster of activities. First, we trained the drone, and we also had a lecture how to do everything. Very interesting, um, and it was a cool way to see a different survey technique uh, to get a big area in. Uh, we also then looked at the image and looked at how you could analyze this, so this was pretty interesting, especially for the techie people. We then went to the Turtle Sanctuary and that was really cool to see the great amount of work that such few people are doing. Um, so they're really trying to raise awareness um, for uh, turtle conservation on the island especially. Um, and so we actually got to see a beach where the turtles usually nest and we got to clean up that beach. So that was really cool to put that into practice. So the activities were really interesting. We went in the mangrove area. It was really nice because I'm like, coming from also a tropical island, so it was nice to compare the different type of mangrove we had. We have really good explanation about the balance of ecosystem, the, um, the different trees we can find in the mangroves. And then at the end, the community work we've done, like for local, uh, local cuisine and also like um, how to, um, to do an artisanal uh, object. It was really interesting to see all of everybody around the CTU, uh, CTU wetland to organize itself around ecotourism. So it was a perfect experience. We love CTU wetland! Uh, we were in the Behwa cave in the Kenyir lake and it was pretty nice to see the historical limestone structures. It was also fascinating to find out that we were in the largest limestone cave in the Terengganu area. Um, what that teaches our students is techniques for in-situ monitoring, in-situ um, restoration of, of corals and coral habitat and understanding how these biogenic reefs are impacted by wider land use in uh, the area. That is, for instance, agriculture, but also tourism and similar activities. So as I said, students make the field course what it is. And so it's my personal thank you to the group this year for putting all your full efforts, your energy and your motivation into the programme. I hope you've all enjoyed it as much as we have on the staff team and I hope you'll carry some of the, the memories that we've made with you going forwards into your, your future adventures. Yeah!